Hello guys, welcome back to the channel. Today we're gonna make one of my favorite meal. I got obsessed with a slow cooker, so I am trying to do everything in a slow cooker. And we're gonna do a grass-fed uh, beef uh, stew with very simple ingredients. And we just throw everything into the pot and let it cook on its own so we can get many other things done in the meantime. And if you are new here, I do videos just like this one, or we actually do videos just like this one with wins. And if you are interested in keto recipes and this topic, then hit that red subscribe button and the bell so you don't miss off any of our videos. And now let's get cooking. So actually the major, major part of this video is my slow cooker. I love it. It costs $70, very good investment. And you can just program it and leave it and just go to work, come back for fresh uh, ready-made food or go to sleep and wake up on the morning with lunch you can take with you. And we're gonna use uh, grass-fed beef, uh, some onions, some carrots for taste, some mushrooms, garlic, little bit of butter and simple spices like Celtic sea salt, pepper, garlic salt, paprika and just an all-purpose spice and we're just gonna mix everything together and put it into the pot and let it cook for several hours on its own. As a very first step, we will just chop up the onions. And you can just chop them up for bigger pieces. You don't have to make smaller pieces. This is fine. And now you can set it aside. We will cut the carrots into smaller pieces. Of course, you don't have to eat the carrots, but it gives a really, really nice taste to the meat. You can chop up some mushrooms into bigger chunks. And now you can do the same with your beef and just cut it into smaller pieces. Now when everything is chopped up, you will just place everything into your slow cooker. I put a little bit of butter on the bottom and then I will add some onion onto the bottom, some carrots, some mushrooms and then the meat. Just like this and then you can add the rest of the onions on top. You can stick some more carrots in it, some more mushrooms. And then now you can start with the spices and you can add very generally the sea salt. You can add an all-purpose spicing, a little bit of red paprika powder, a little bit of black pepper. And if you want, you can add some garlic salt as well. And of course, some real garlic. And then you can just throw them in here as well. And you can add about a deciliter or two deciliter of water into this and just put on the top. And now I will just program my slow cooker. I will put it on high heat and put it for three and a half hour. All right, so now we will wait three and a half hours, four hours, four hours to, to get ready. But in this time, you can just go get other things done, go meet with your friends or work or do whatever you want. And by the time you get back, you will have the meal. And now the stew is fully ready. It's really nice and soft and i will serve it with some cabbage rice this is my favorite one and then you can of course cook it a little bit but actually i really like it raw 
So I will just have some raw on the side and then serve the stew next to it. And then you can definitely top it off with some sour cream to make it prettier and creamier. And here you go, this is the full meal, the easy, simple keto stew with some cabbage rice. All right, now I'm gonna enjoy my stew for dinner and I wish you the same. Go grab a bowl and have a really nice, cozy stew for this evening. And if you like this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, comment and share, of course. And see you in my next video. Bye-bye, guys.